for you, what has been the greatest joy from serving others? What would oh you What would you say to someone that they can get out of this? Because we we often think of all the obstacles that we face with serving, and what is a joy? What is what, what do we have to look forward to? Well, the joy of the Lord is not always a feeling. It's a certainty. It's like marriage. Do you feel joyful every day? Don't don't say anything. Do you feel joyful every day with your spouse? I mean, come on. But you love each other to death. There are moments of laughter. The Bible says there are seasons to cry, seasons to laugh, seasons to mourn. You, there's no such thing as the hunky-dory Christian smiley laughing, I feel good today, every day, forever and ever, amen, until he comes in the clouds of glory. That's right. Then shall we forever be with the Lord. Until that day, we live in an imperfect planet that has all of this sin that's been around, and, and sinners who, despite their best efforts, still have, have managed to hurt each other. Uh, but in the midst of that, regardless of the unfortunate uh, unfairness mm -hmm. of life, we move forward. Mm -hmm. We move forward. And forgiveness is the key. Yeah. Amen. Now I can give of myself because it began with forgiveness. Joseph forgave each time, and now anything his hand touched flourished because he was faithful regardless of his fears and his feelings and his pain. I'm sure he cried out, my God, why have you forsaken me? And, and, and the prison got the best food and water they ever had. <laughs> <laughs>